just got one more question before we go to the next super chat. Um, someone you and Perfect worked with during this period was uh, the Ultimate Warrior. Um, I would imagine you've got a few Ultimate Warrior stories. Yeah, you know, um, he got remarried. He had two beautiful daughters. I saw them in the WrestleMania. Uh, no, the uh, when I inducted my brother into the Hall of Fame. Yeah. So I would really rather not say anything negative about Ultimate War because he's got those two little girls that are now big girls. It's just that there was a girl with me in New Orleans the year before I inducted my brother. And they didn't want to put him in, in New Orleans because they only like to do one posthumous inductee per year. And that year, the dead person was um, Paul Bearer. Oh. Okay. So I had a girl with me as a date. And she kept saying, can I meet this guy? Can I meet this, that way, that guy? He said, oh, there's the ultimate warrior. Can you introduce me to him? And I said, no, if you want to meet him, you're going to have to do it yourself. She says, why not? I said, I don't like him, and I have nothing to say to him, and I don't want to go near him. Wow. And, you know, how do I feel about he only lived a few more days? Um, he was just a guy that had a fantastic body that they fell in love with. They gave him a mega push. And he never learned to work. You know, he, he, had, he had no respect for the business. He had no respect for anybody except Ultimate and Warrior. Uh, and, and it was that selfish greed that caused his career to curtail. Right. Now, I, I just said I didn't want to say anything bad about him. And I just did. But I, at least I was vague about it. Right. Uh, he was, um, let's put it this way. He was not a nice man. And I apologize to anybody I'm hurting, uh, but it's just that when you invited me on the show, I thought I would at least try my best to be honest. Well, that's what we like here, man. We like be truthful and honest and give your honest opinion. But I'll be honest, his greatest match was against your brother, Randy. That yeah, I Randy seen. liked him. And what Randy would do is... He wouldn't have to make a list because he had a razor blade mind, okay? Mm -hmm. He, in his mind, he made a list of everything he did well and everything he didn't do well. And Randy would make sure all the things that Ultimate Warrior did well was in the match. And he, he, he wouldn't let him do the other stuff. Uh... Okay, and, you know, Randy watched several of his tapes and decided, I can work with this. And we... Right. And uh, boy, wasn't it a great match? You know, it, it was something. Well, like I said, it was the best match I ever seen Warrior have by far. Yeah. And it was in uh, Wembley Stadium. That's Is right. That where it was? I thought. So, so uh, they had two: uh, Mania Seven and uh, Mania Seven, Summer, Summer, yeah. Summer, Summer, Summer Slam '92 for the title. Yeah.